Modify the get employees method in the HR uh, resource. Modify the get employees method in the HR resource class in the HR savvy to return employees list of object into the uh, instead of the HR instead of the list em, list of employees object. So we are going to go to the get employees in the HR resource in the HR service and then we are going to modify the 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 get employees method so that is going to return employees list object instead of list of employees so let's see how it works so we are going to go to HR microservice so we are going to go to HR microservice and we are going to go to HR resource and now we are going to modify the this method so instead of returning list of employees it returns employees list right so now first I'm going to I'm going to um, come here and change it to employees list So that is what we are going to return, okay? So at this point, we are going to create a new employees list object. So I'm going to say, um, I'm going to say employees list employees list equal to new employees list, okay? I'm going to say employees list dot set employees is going to now take uh, employees. Okay. So and then it returns employees lists. So now, if it's a bit confusing for you, try to pause the video or try to ask me. Maybe I could make a simpler video to clarify this. All right. So now we are going to check where we are in the stream of time. So create positions object. So we've done this. We've done this. Okay. Create the employees list class in the HR service model package so it's going to be great in the models package so i'm going to now create employees list in the hr i'm going to say create class employees list and it's going to be in the models package okay all right so we have now employees list so this employees list is going to have um it's going to have so public list employee is going to list employee employees public list employee employees okay so we need a, a get on a site so we are simply going to go to to get create getters and setters right so I'm going to come here import this okay, perfect so we've created an employees list object this employees list is built using list of employees so this class takes a list of employees and converts it to employees list object list employees is list of items but employees list is just an object that contains a list. So maybe I can just illustrate it. Uh, so we are talking about we have lists of employees. Sorry, this is and we have employees list. So this is an object this object contains a list so inside this object we have this list but this one has several employees e1 e2 
and so on. So this is more like several lists of items. And why it would be a problem using it is because when we try to use REST template, REST template wants an object, wants us to return an object and not a list. Although you can modify, try to manipulate or return a list, but REST template actually needs an object. So instead of using a list, we use an object called employees list object. All right. So let's see where we are at this point. So create employees list class, which we've done. So I'm going to mark this as green. 